Do you want to avoid empty tables at peak times due to last minute cancellations? Res Diaries online standby list helps you retain potential customers ahead of service and notify them if a table becomes available. This film will show you how to set up an online standby list, what the diner sees on the widget, how to manage this from your diary, and how availability on the list is controlled. It is important to note that the standby list is different from our waitlist feature that allows you to manage walk-ins during service. For a full guide to the waitlist, watch the film linked in the descriptor. To enable the online standby list, from your diary, click Settings and from the Diary Configuration section, click Online Settings. Here, scroll to Online Settings and check the box for Allow customers to add themselves to standby list. The standby list will only be offered on the days you have activated to accept online bookings. You can make changes to this above in the Bookings Accepted On section. Once happy, click Save and the standby list will be active. Now, when the diner is making a booking using the widget, a clock icon will appear on days where the standby list is available. When selecting a time, the clock icon and Join Standby List will appear next to any time slot that is currently fully booked. The diner selects this time and adds their contact details. Before they complete the process, the button reminds the diner that they are joining a standby list, not making a booking. In the diary, on the top left, a pink notification appears showing you have diners on the standby list for that day. If a time slot becomes available, click to open the menu. Here you will see the details of all diners on the list including their preferred dining time, their name, number of covers, any comment attached to the booking, their contact details if you would like to contact them directly, when the diner was added to the standby list, and some options to edit the comments, check availability in the booking tool, mark the diner as a no-show, or delete the entry from the standby list. Finally, you can notify the diner that a slot has become available. This will send an email to the diner that notifies them there is availability and links them to the booking widget on your Dish Cult listing, where they can make a booking. The email will also include the venue contact details so that the diner can follow up directly. The amount of availability on your standby list is controlled by your yield management. The diary will only offer 50% of your maximum cover yield to the standby list. This means that if you have a maximum yield of 10 covers per time slot, only 5 spaces will be offered on the standby list. This is specifically connected to cover caps and not any booking caps. For more information about managing your yield, watch the film linked in the descriptor. Diners will not be able to add themselves to the standby list on days where you are closed or there is a closeout in place. To get support when you need it, click the help icon and submit a ticket to one of our support team members who will pick it up and send you the solution. Search the knowledge base for step-by-step -step guides or if you are unable to access the above, email us on support at resdiary.com and we will be in touch with you as soon as possible.